I am Takashi Yamamoto from uh, the Osaka University, professor of the Osaka University and uh, deputy director of the Center for uh, Quantum Information, uh, Quantum Biology on Osaka University. And today I would like to uh, introduce the uh, progress of our uh, uh, project in uh, 2.5 years. And this is our vision of uh, this uh, project. And this project aims to develop uh, elemental uh, technologies for networking uh, quantum computers with uh, photons and atoms and superconduct uh, semi semiconductors and superconducting stars, and aiming to network uh, small and medium uh, quantum computers. And we further promote uh, networked quantum computers on a large scale uh, towards the uh, achievement of this uh, uh, universal quantum computer by uh, 2050. And we uh, like to creating the uh, large scale uh, quantum computer. At the same time, we would like to pro uh, protect the network against the uh, uh, attacks from the uh, quantum computers uh, in this uh, project. And here I show the uh, overview of our uh, research team for uh, networking uh, various uh, quantum hardware. And we have uh, four groups dealing with uh, four different kinds of physical systems, atoms and photons and semiconductors and superconductors. And each of those groups is uh, run by an expert in uh, each field. And we also have uh, two groups uh, developing a superconducting uh, single photon uh, detector technology that is a key for uh, creating a photonic quantum network. And in our project, at this moment, uh, overall participants are 72, including uh, 29 researchers and uh, 36 students and uh, seven support staffs. Uh, we, are, we also collaborate with other teams and our project tightly to achieve uh, this, uh, the goal of Moonshot project. And here is the uh, overview of our project. And as I also already mentioned, that uh, uh, we developed a networking technology for uh, atoms and photons and semiconductor and superconducting qubits. Uh, for such uh, various quantum hardware, we will develop uh, quantum interfaces or transducers with uh, photons. Uh, for interfacing the uh, multiple qubits, uh, we will develop a uh, multiplex uh, photonic routing technology and also the high performance and highly multiplex uh, photon detectors. And I, in some uh, hardware, we also develop a method for uh, direct connection between uh, qubits. And from the next slides, I uh, present the progresses of uh, each uh, research team one by one. And the, the first one is our group in Osaka University. Our group is the, in charge of the uh, networking technology for neutral atom qubits. And our group has a long-term experience on a photonic uh, quantum co information processing. But in uh, 2018, uh, based on the atomic ensemble experiment here, uh, we demonstrated atom telecom photon uh, entanglement uh, with the uh, frequency, uh, quantum frequency conversion, as uh, the already uh, uh, Professor Harald uh, Win uh, Weinfurter uh, already said. And based on those uh, technologies, uh, in this project, we try to connect atom array uh, quantum computers with a uh, photonic quantum network. Uh, yesterday in a uh, uh, neutral atom session, uh, there are a uh, lot of exciting uh, talks on uh, atom array. I was also excited uh, about the uh, progress of their uh, team, uh, the project. And uh, replacing our uh, atom ensemble by the atom array, uh, we can uh, create uh, multiple atom photon uh, entanglement and atom, atom entanglement and and connect the uh, uh, atom, array, uh, atom array quantum computers. Uh, in the uh, Professor uh, Weinfutter's uh, wonderful talk, and the entanglement uh, generation between atom and photon has been already shown, and also atom atom entanglement has been shown. Uh, in our project, we also develop uh, photon uh, routing technology and multiple uh, photon detectors for the uh, multiplex atoms. Our uh, five years uh, target is to show the ability to connect the atom arrays by a uh, photonic quantum net uh, communication. 
And here I show the uh, progress of our uh, group. And we start uh, preparing the uh, uh, atom array uh, experiment at the, uh, uh, at the beginning of the, uh, this project. And we prepare uh, beam arrays for the uh, uh, optical dipole trap with a uh, spatial light modulator and the SLM. And the uh, uh, trapped atoms are observed by the, this uh, QCMOS camera from the uh, Hamamas Photonics. And now we have uh, seven times uh, 10 sites atom array and uh, roughly 50% uh, uh, filling factor has been uh, achieved. This is a standard uh, specs of the, uh, 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 in the atom array experiment. And the, uh, we uh, also prepared a single photon detection system and the, uh, super co uh, with the uh, superconducting nanowire detectors. Then uh, we are uh, doing the experiment of multiple uh, single photon generation from this atom array yeah, now. So the, uh, in fact, uh, since uh, we are the uh, first customer of the, uh, this uh, QCMOS camera, uh, our first atom array has been uh, displayed on uh, Hamamatsu Photonics uh, website for the application note. And uh, it's not fancy enough, but uh, our first uh, drone uh, picture uh, with the atom array was a symbol of our uh, university. We are proud of that. And uh, it represents a uh, uh, ginkgo leaf uh, in Japan. And if you are uh, interested in our first atom array, uh, please visit uh, Hamamatsu Hotonics uh, website. And in uh, collaboration with the uh, Seori project, uh, we are uh, now uh, considering the milestone experimental studies for uh, distributed uh, quantum computation uh, for uh, uh, F FTQC for this uh, moonshot program. And especially uh, for the uh, distributed uh, quantum computation, uh, logical uh, Bell state distillation is important in many aspects of uh, implementing the uh, algorithms. Uh, now we are uh, considering such a, a protocol with a surface code of two-dimensional qubit arrays. And the uh, protocol starts uh, from the uh, physical Bell state distribution uh, through the uh, photonic quantum communication. And, uh, uh, and that, that will uh, succeed uh, probabilistically, uh, as already uh, Professor Weinfutter said, but uh, successfully uh, distributed Bell pairs will be uh, rearranged or uh, swapped such that they form the uh, surface code in a, a smaller uh, two-dimensional uh, qubit array. And uh, now we uh, studied uh, practically achievable parameters for this uh, protocol, and which will be a good uh, midterm uh, goal in our uh, project. Uh, for the uh, uh, multiple qubit array, uh, we need to switch the uh, link operation in uh, uh, several aspects. So we have recently found a nice property of uh, quantum frequency uh, conversion as as a, a optical switch, and in the uh, first experiment we show the this function as a optical uh, frequency tweezers, and now we use the same functionality to the uh, optical switch uh, that switch the photons uh, to the uh, desired uh, WDM uh, mode. And uh, I'm not going into the details of this uh, photon routing, but we have successfully demonstrated switching the uh, photon of the frequency mode by changing the uh, pump laser uh, modes here. And also, let's, let us uh, move on to the, uh, another uh, group. Uh, Shimoi group is in charge of the uh, multi-channel uh, photon detection technology with uh, superconducting nanowire detectors. And the group is very uh, famous in the product of photomultiply tube, uh, PMT. Uh, they produce uh, many kinds of PMT for uh, various applications. Uh, this uh, biggest uh, PMT uh, tube is used for uh, detecting uh, neutrinos in Kamiokande on the uh, Super Kamiokande. And, and they, uh, estab uh, they establish a core technology, for example, uh, high vacuum packaging, uh, thin film uh, deposition, and uh, single photon detection, and so on. 
So the world's uh, smallest and uh, lightest micro uh, PMT uh, shows that uh, very uh, high level technology, especially for the uh, commercialization. Uh, in this uh, project, in collaboration with uh, NICT group, uh, they will uh, develop a multi-channel SNS PD system, including a uh, cryostat and uh, multiple uh, fiber ports. And they establish a manufacturing technology for uh, superconducting thin film and realizing uh, stable uh, production of uh, SNS PD with the uh, high performance uh, photon detection technology uh, from NICT. And they will also uh, build a high performance cryostat, which achieves uh, mounting a large number of uh, SNSPD and stable operation for a long time. And the uh, five year target of this project is the development of a 100 channel scale uh, multi channel uh, SNSPD system and to contribute to the other uh, projects too. And the target of the uh, performance of the SNSPD is shown uh, here. And the target uh, wavelengths are 780 nanometer and uh, 1550 nanometer, but uh, they also develop others. And typical detection efficiency and jitters are 90% and 50 uh, picosecond. And overall channel will be uh, more than uh, uh, 50 channel per uh, wavelength. And especially for the uh, product, uh, long uh, continuous operation will be uh, achieved. And the uh, developed uh, SNSPD system uh, will be uh, provided to each uh, research team. And we expect that such a multiple uh, multi channel system will, be, will enhance the quantum communication capacity. And the current status of the uh, manu manufacturing uh, facility is the uh, following. And they uh, now uh, uh, set up a superconducting thin film uh, spatter and wedge, uh, wedge bonders and mask uh, aligners, uh, maskless aligners, and so on. And those e equipments allow uh, complete uh, SNSPD uh, fabrication and packaging. And ex except for the EB lithography, that part is uh, performed in collaboration with uh, NICT. Uh, this is the uh, first. Uh, is, uh, uh, Hamamatsu Photonics uh, SNSBT system, which is uh, provided to our group and tested the performance. Uh, the system has a 12 channel optical fiber port and the uh, drive and readout port. Unfortunately, one channel is under uh, adjustment, but uh, all the other uh, channels are properly uh, worked. And the detection efficiencies are uh, from 70% uh, to the 82% uh, with a reasonable dark count rate and timing jitter. And this system is installed in our group and our, uh, uh, the system has been experimentally tested uh, with our uh, entangled photon sources. Uh, uh, sorry, uh, uh, this is uh, written in Japanese, but uh, the successful uh, demonstration is announced on the Japanese optoelectronics journals. And this is uh, the uh, 32 channel system is now uh, under construction. And in fact, the system has been already uh, constructed and with the uh, 32 uh, dummy uh, SNSPDs and coaxial cables. And they already uh, checked the uh, cooling performance. And the uh, system successfully uh, cooled down to the uh, standard operating temperature at around 2.2 Kelvin. And the system has been uh, displayed at uh, G7 uh, Science and Technology Ministry to communicate in this uh, May. And we hope uh, it will be soon uh, completed and installed, in our, uh, info, uh, installed for the, our research. And uh, Miki, uh, Dr. Miki Group in uh, NICT is in charge of the uh, high performance uh, SNSPD uh, development. And his uh, group has a long time, uh, long history on uh, developing uh, SNSPDs in Japan. And since 2006, uh, they began uh, building uh, SNSPD and uh, contribute to the improve the system detection efficiency up to more than 80%. And their uh, uh, SNSPD system has been uh, installed in Tokyo QKD network and uh, operated more than 10 years in the field. And recently, they have also built a uh, SNSPD array with a superconducting digital uh, readout for the uh, multi-pixel uh, multi applications. 
And uh, in this uh, project, his group will further improve the uh, performance of uh, SNSPDs. And for the uh, single channel SNSPD uh, in uh, uh, five years, the uh, wavelength range will be uh, extended to the UV regime, uh, regime for uh, trapped ion qubits. And the uh, detection efficiency will be uh, more than 95%. Uh, and the dark count rate will be improved from uh, 10 counts per second to below uh, 0 0.1 counts per second. Uh, here I show a part of the progress of this uh, group. And for uh, 780 nanometer, uh, they already achieved uh, 0 0 0.005 count per second at the uh, saturated uh, detection efficiency. This is remarkably low. And for uh, 8050 nanometer, and the uh, detection efficiency reaches 90.3%, uh, but the dark count rate uh, already uh, increased at the uh, level of uh, 10 count per second. So now they try to achieve both uh, high detection efficiency and low dark count rate at the same time. And especially uh, last year, they tried to uh, eliminate uh, black body radiation through the uh, optical fibers. And the, uh, those results are the elementary, uh, preliminary results for eliminating uh, black body uh, radiation to achieve the uh, low dark count rate. Uh, they try to, uh, they try two st strategies for filtering the uh, black body, and one is the uh, directly coating on the uh, input surface of the uh, SNSPD device. And the other one is uh, the electric coating uh, on the uh, output port for of the uh, optical fiber. And at, th at this moment in a uh, fiber case, yeah, uh, it seems the uh, black body radiation is uh, radiation reduction uh, is achieved without a uh, significant de uh, degradation of the uh, detection efficiency. And they also try to establish a uh, a uh, scalable uh, multi-channel uh, SNSPD system by combining SNSPD array device technology and uh, optical fiber array. I'm not going to the details of the topic, in, uh, but uh, they are uh, playing with the uh, SNSPD array with the uh, SFQ circuit. And they also contributed to the uh, other project with uh, their uh, high performance uh, SNSPD uh, SNSPD is a Furusawa group or a, a Takahashi group. And uh, Aoki group in uh, Waseda University is in charge of uh, developing photon networking technology uh, based on uh, cavity QED. Uh, as he have uh, already uh, talked, and uh, his group has a long-term experience on uh, cavity QED, and his remarkable cavity QED system is based on nanofiber with uh, fiber black grating. In this project, uh, his uh, group uses this uh, system to generate a uh, multi photon uh, quantum network. And they will uh, uh, first try to generate a pure single uh, photon qubit state uh, sequentially, and which realize the uh, photonic qubit array. And by changing the uh, interaction between the atom and photon, they will uh, generate one dimensional cluster state in the uh, uh, optical fiber. And this is the uh, five-year target of this project. And by combining multiple uh, cavity QED system, uh, they will further uh, try to uh, generate a uh, 2D cluster state. OK, Oiwa group is uh, in Osaka University is in charge of uh, networking uh, technology for uh, semiconductor qubits. The group has uh, three targets for uh, connecting uh, silicon qubit. And target one is the uh, photon, uh, photon to uh, silicon qubit uh, transducer with a uh, germanium uh, quantum dot and superconducting resonator. And the target two is the uh, coupling between the silicon qubit by uh, using a quantum dot array and superconducting resonator. And target three is the uh, creation of uh, entanglement between a remote uh, spin qubits via, uh, by uh, uh, entangled photon pairs. Uh, Oiwa group has a long-term experience on a uh, uh, semiconductor qubit of electron spins in a uh, uh, quantum dot, uh, especially for uh, gallium arsenide 
And now the group try to switch the material from、uh, gallium arsenide to、uh, germanium. And germanium is a、uh, group for、uh, semiconductor and whole system, and less nuclear spins and strong、uh, spin orbit interaction、uh, enables、uh, long coherence time and fast manipulation. A very、uh, good property is the、uh, narrow band gap、uh, that enables、uh, telecom band、uh, photon、uh, spin、uh, quantum interfaces for、uh, connecting、uh, remote、uh, quantum dots. And now they try to、uh, form a quantum dot in germanium with,、uh, provided by uh, Professor uh, Sawano and other,、uh, and then、uh, observed uh, uh, quantum dot like behavior. And、uh, Theoretical work in、uh, collaboration with、uh, Professor Tokura、uh, group has been also、uh, started. And during the uh, uh, preparation of、uh, germanium and silicon platform,、uh, the group performs、uh, several proof of principle experiments in a、uh, gallium arsenide platform. And one is the、uh, highly,、uh, high fidelity、uh, spin qubit、uh, operation in a quantum dot array system. And by using the、uh, inter dot、uh, tunneling in a double、uh, quantum dot, uh, fast、uh, Rabi frequency and long、uh, Rabi relaxation time are achieved at the same time. And this technique will provide a novel qubit control in a quantum dot array. And also, the group、uh, e x p e c t the、uh, method i m p r o v e the、uh, coupling with the、uh, superconducting resonator. And here I、uh, show the, uh, uh, the other、uh, pro progresses. And one is the、uh, development of、uh, new uh, uh, photon spin、uh, interfaces that allow us. Uh, the continuous uh, single, photo,、uh, single, single photon、uh, electron, single photo electron detection for uh, enhancement uh, for uh, the、uh, entanglement conversion from the uh, uh, photon pairs. And the other one is the uh, ex, uh, extension of the coherence time by feedback. The feedback is based on the machine learning of the、uh, nuclear spins fluctuations.、Uh, without the degradation of the fidelity,、uh, the coherence time extension has been、uh, realized. And the inter、uh, project uh, collaboration on、uh, coupling via、uh, quantum dot array is also、uh, active between a t a r c h a project and、uh, others. And here,、uh, developed、uh, gate structure is studied for the intermediate coupling between a silicon qubit. And the, uh, the uh, accelerated adiabatic passage of the single photon spin qubit has been、uh, demonstrated, and they will、uh, speed up the、uh, adiabatic passage. Of, of、uh, spin qubit. And、uh, let us、uh, move on to the、uh, research team on uh, networking uh, superconducting uh, qubits. And Kubo Group at Okinawa、uh, Institute of、uh, Science and Technology, OIST, is in charge of this、uh, project. And this、uh, team、uh, focuses, focuses on the、uh, microwave to optical regime、uh, quantum transducer. Uh, which is、uh, useful for、uh, connecting、uh, remote、uh, superconducting qubits. And within、uh, five years,、uh, this uh, team uh, demonstrates、uh, such a transducer. And、uh, uh, 10 years' target for of this、uh, team is to connect remote superconducting、uh, quantum processors、uh, through optical、uh, quantum communication. Uh, in this subject,、uh, quantum transducers、uh, consist of ensemble spins of、uh, silicon vacancy in diamond. And the、uh, mechanism of the、uh, transducer is、uh, very similar to the、uh, quantum、uh, frequency conversion in the、uh, optical regime. And the, so,、uh, in principle, the conversion efficiency from a、uh, microwave to the optical photon is.、Uh, 100% and the、uh, coherence is preserved in the、uh, conversion process. And in practice,、uh, for both、uh, microwave and optical photon, we need,、uh, to, we need、uh, a cavity to enhance the coupling strengths、uh, for the、uh, efficient conversion. And、uh, optical flying photons、uh, can be used for the,、uh, carrying the、uh, quantum state from the、uh, dilution refrigerator to the optical fiber at the、uh, room temperature. And then、uh, we can、uh, make a quantum link、uh, between、uh, superconducting quantum processors located in the different、uh, dilution、uh, refrigerators. And the、uh, uh, superconducting qubit will be、uh, provided by uh, Professor uh, uh, Yamamoto、uh, Tsuyoshi group. 
in uh, NEC and or uh, uh, Nakamura project uh, of the QLIP. Uh, here I show the uh, progress of this uh, team. And they first test the uh, cryogenic uh, optical uh, cavity housing design with the uh, FSR of uh, five, uh, about five gigahertz and the finesse of uh, 300. And inside of the uh, dilution refrigerator, uh, they, uh, they have stabilized uh, this uh, optical cavity. And the uh, performance of the microwave resonator is also observed. And the uh, resonance frequency was about uh, 6.35 uh, gigahertz, and the quality factor was uh, uh, 1,500. And the uh, Q factor will be improved at the uh, cryogenic temperature. And now they uh, try to uh, perform an experiment with uh, diamond samples uh, with the uh, hybrid, uh, this kind of uh, hybrid cavity system. Uh, this is a summary of our project. Our project develops uh, various uh, quantum interfaces for a uh, quantum network among uh, static qubit and photons. And we also uh, develop uh, Photonic, uh, quantum te uh, photonic technologies, including uh, photon multiplexing and routing technologies, and also uh, high-performance uh, multiplex uh, single photon detection system. And in collaboration with the uh, other project, we are uh, considering uh, milestone experimental studies for uh, distributed quantum computation uh, for uh, FTQC for this moonshot project program. And our five-year target is to demonstrate a full lineup of these uh, elemental technologies for uh, networking quantum computers. Uh, based on those uh, technologies, uh, we will try to demonstrate a large-scale uh, uh, quantum computers with uh, quantum network in, uh, five, uh, in 10 years. Uh, those those targets will be achieved in collaboration with other uh, teams and projects. And fi finally, uh, I would like to uh, acknowledge all the particip participants of this uh, project and the uh, support from the uh, Cabinet Office and uh, MEXT and JST. Uh, thank you for your attention.